Hi everyone, greetings from beautiful Cyprus. Welcome to my channel. I'm Anastasia Bayaku. I'm a certified master yoga teacher from Yoga Alliance International of India and I'm here today to show you an easy class for early in the morning to wake up the body, to fill it with energy, to start your day. As always, you go as far as you can, as far as you feel like going, all right, as far as you feel comfortable and that's it. Enough talking, let's do it. Bye. So we're going to start from Sukhasana. Now breathe in and breathe out. And again, breathe in and breathe out. One more time, breathe in and breathe out. Now let's open our arms to the side. Open, open, open our arms. There we go. To the right and to the left and right and left. Now let's bring both hands together. Interlace some fingers, leave only the pointer, shoulders are down, breathe in and lean to the right, look either up or in front and return, breathe in and lean to the left, again look either up or in front and return, now breathe in and breathe out, bring both hands down. Breathe in again. And breathe out. Nice. Now I want you to lift both your arms You're up there. Hmm? Shoulders are down. Hmm? Looking either up or in front. And try to open your chest. Hmm? Try to open your chest as far as you can. And breathe in. And breathe out. And again, breathe in. And breathe out. One more time, breathe in. And breathe out. And release. That's it. All right? Mm -hmm. Now again, breathe in. And breathe out. There we go. And now we're going to open the right leg there, bring your left to your thigh, breathe in and breathe out, open your arms again to the side. Now I want your right hand and your right leg together there, lean them over your chest, look either up or in front, breathe in and going down towards the leg there, looking either up or in front. And return, now breathe in and breathe out. And now we're going to place the right hand outside of the knee there, grabbing our knee. And again, left hand up, breathe in and going down towards the leg again, towards the right leg. Again, looking either up or in front. And return, breathe in and breathe out. Now bring your foot down, hand down. Let's open our arms to the side. They are having a nice stretch here. Enjoy it. There we go. A nice, nice stretch. And breathe in, open your on the side and bring the knee a little bit further back so you can be able to lift now your right leg. Staying here, that's it. Mm -hmm. Looking either up or in front. Now we're gonna have a nice straight line there. Pelvis is inward, right, strong. 
strong gluteus. Now breathe in and breathe out, just close them. That's it. Don't grab your leg, don't grab your toe, just close. And again, breathe in and breathe out. And again, breathe in and breathe out. And again, breathe in and breathe out. Now stay there. Just stay there, nothing else. That's it. Feel it working. And now let's bend and grab it and stretch it back. There we go. Just stretch it back. And you can bring it to the front and bring it either above the knee or maybe higher. Push your knee, mm, a nice straight line, and just a nice stretch here. That's it. Now breathe in. And coming down. And now we're going to stretch the left. And we're gonna do, mm, again, the same thing. Now right foot on our inner thigh, breathe in again, open and breathe out, looking either up or in front, going down towards the left side this time, looking again there, either up or in front. If you have neck problems, keep your neck as straight uh, as possible, all right? And breathe in, there we go, both hands up and breathe out. And this time, left hand outside the knee, right hand up, breathe in and breathe out. Again, going down as far as you can, as far as you feel comfortable going. And just enjoy it. Remember, the stretches is all about the stretch. Right, we don't really care how far down you're gonna go, we don't really care how impressive the pose is going to be. All right, and now breathe in and breathe out. Now, let's place our foot down, hand down, and again, have a nice stretch here. There we go. Let's wake our body there and enjoy, just enjoy it. All right. There it is. Now breathe in. Mm -hmm. Arms in a straight line. Bring your knee maybe a little bit further back so you'll be able to lift now the left leg. Looking either up or in front. Straight line there. Now breathe in and breathe out. There we go. Closing and again breathe in. Open and breathe out. Close and again open. Time open, breathe in, and breathe out. We're going to stay there this time, stay there. Feel it, mm -hmm. feel it working. There we go. Now we're going to bend it and grab it and stretch it back. There it is. to bring the leg either above the knee like this, that's it, maybe higher, up to you. Push the knee back and have a nice stretch here as well. And then again, coming down, there we go. Stay here, now breathe in. And breathe out. One more time, lift ourselves up, breathe in. And breathe out. Open the arms to the side. Let's open the right leg there. 
breathe in and let's go to the right there right hand the leg looking it up or in front again feel the nice stretch there and breathe in there we go and breathe out now sit down on your leg there both hands down and just lean forward bend forward so you have a nice stretch for your back and your leg now both hands down breathe in and right leg in and again breathe in coming up and breathe out and again lifting ourselves breathe in and breathe out open our arms to the side now let's open the left leg there breathe in left hand left leg there we go the gate pose looking either in the front or up again feel the nice stretch that's it all right And breathe in and breathe out. Now both hands down, sitting back on our leg, breathe in and going down there. Feel a nice stretch. Now both hands up, right down. There we go. And let's turn in front and step back. And we are in Kubakasana, so Chaturanga Tadasana. There we go. And upper dog, breathe in. And then back to down dog. Adho Mukhasvanasana. There we go. And both arms straight as possible, both palms down, pushing, pushing, our back to get as straight as possible. And of course, the pelvis is up. Now breathe in and bend the right leg. And at the same time, push your left foot, your left heel down, there. And then breathe in. Bend the left and push the right heel down. Enjoy it, just enjoy it guys, that's it. And again, breathe in and bend the right. Just push the heel down, that's it. And breathe in, now bend the left. And heel down. Now breathe in and bend them both. Bring your knees down. Breathe in, look up. And breathe out, look into your belly. And again, breathe in, look up. And breathe out, look into your belly. Breathe in, look in front, and let's walk the right hand in front there. Bend the left and bring your forehead down to the mat. Have a nice stretch. Your right side. And return. There we go right hand back now left hand in front bend your right elbow bring your forehead down and have a nice stretch to your left left side now and 
and then palm down and return. Now breathe in, again look out and breathe out, look, look into your belly, breathe in, look in front, there, both legs up, toes down, now let's bring, let's bring our elbows down, there, hmm? elbows down. Interlace your fingers, there we go. So toes are down, stretching the legs, there we go. And breathe in, in front, over hands, and breathe out, back. That's the dolphin pose. And again, breathe in, in front, and breathe out, back. And breathe in, in front, and back. One more time, stay there, in front, and that's it. Now let's bring ourselves down, both hands in each side of our chest, breathe in, pelvis is down, and lifting ourselves, pushing ourselves up into a nice combra, Bhujangasana. Of course, you're allowed to bring your hands a little further away if you want to make it a little bit more easy, right, for you. Hmm? Or, of course, if you're flexible enough, you can stay there, looking either up or in front. Now, when I say look up, I don't mean this, right? Don't stretch your neck too much. Just look up, that's it, all right? And then, Let's bring ourselves down, there we go. And now let's bend the right leg and grab it with the right hand. Breathe in, bring your left arm in front and breathe out. Lift yourself up. And going down, and now we're going to do the same thing with the left, so we're bending the left leg, grab with the left hand, right arm in front, breathe in, and lifting ourselves up. Now both hands down, breathe in, and pushing ourselves back, pelvis mm, on our heels, opening your knees to the side, see that? There. And I'm going to bring now my hands either in front, like this, and bring my forehead down, like that, or if you're flexible enough, you can bring your hands inside in between the legs, grabbing the heels there, and bring your cheek, your right cheek down and stay here and relax, that's it, it's a nice one, I promise and of course if you are like this you have to turn the other cheek down as well and staying again Now both hands down and toes down and of course we're going to try to do Pakasana, the easy version of it, all right? So we're going to place our arms below our legs and we're going to play with it there. Mm -hmm. Toes back, toes in front, just play with it, nothing else. Now, if you're comfortable enough to lift yourself, Perfect. If not, just play with it. And of course, if you feel pain on your wrist, hmm, try it one or two times, because we want to strengthen our wrist, okay? And then sit down, all right? Before you feel pain, okay? So if you feel like um, your wrists are not strong enough, 
we need to make them stronger. So we're going to play a little bit there, that's it, without lifting ourselves. Mm? And then we're going to sit down. Okay? No. So we're going to place now our knees down, sitting down, breathe in, and breathe out. And again, breathe in, lifting ourselves up, and breathe out. There we go. Now we're going to open our knees um, in the same line with our pelvis, all right? So pelvis is in, and breathe in, and breathe out. And now breathe in, right hand in front, lift up, bring it behind your um, lower back there, pelvis, between the pelvis and the lower back there, and pushing, and breathe in, lift, yeah, left hand looking either up or maybe in front. Hmm? Now, of course, if you're an advanced student and it's easy for you, you can breathe in and bring your hand to your heel. Again, you can look either up or back. Up to you. Be careful, your pelvis must always be inwards. You must have a strong gluteus as you do this pose. You don't want your gluteus to go back. And again, in order to come up, I'm gonna place my hand again to my lower back and lifting myself up. Breathe in and breathe out. Now we're gonna do the same thing with the left hand. Now breathe in, lift it and bring it to our lower back there. Pushing, helping my pelvis, helping my gluteus um, keep my uh, spine secure. All right, so breathe in. And I'm gonna lift my right hand, looking either up or maybe slide it to the front. And again, if that's easy for you, you can breathe in and bring your hand to your heel. And again, you can either look up, that's the straight now, or back. Keep pushing your pelvis in, keep pushing your gluteus in strong, support your spine. And breathe in. I'm going to return, bring my hand again to my lower back and lifting myself up. Now breathe in. There we go. And breathe out both hands down. Now breathe in. Look up, breathe out. Bring the pelvis in. Look to your belly. That's good for you now. And breathe in. And then push back into a nice balasana. And of course, if you want, you can relax your hands as well and stay there. And that's it for today. Just relax. Namaste. Thank you for watching. If you like my content, please like and subscribe. See you next time. Bye.